Greetings, everyone, and welcome to White Faker Plays Codename Ocean Keeper. This is kind of a split. I don't, there's no music or, or menu at the moment. It'd be good to have a menu at the start before jumping into the tutorial, but that's all right. Um, this is an early build uh, that I've been given to try out. So, yeah, excited to see what this is all about. This is a kind of a split between Dome Keeper resource collection and um, an arena survival type mix i don't know what the upgrades are start like etc but that's what i'm here to, to look at i'm guessing we do want to do the tutorial skip tutorial no and here's something now boom so there's been a a big overhaul in the graphics recently um i said i'd wait for that and then check it out so here we go let's go over the basics use the wasd to move around yeah, cool. Feels like I'm underwater. Now look for the entrance to the cave. There you can get all the necessary resources. All right, looks like this one. Press E at the entrance to the cave to make the miner go down. Here we go. Use the WSD to navigate inside the cave. No worries. How do we pick these things up? Now dig for big blocks uh, with ramming into them. Yeah. And then use E to pick them all up. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, you press E multiple times. Okay. Maybe hold down to grab as many as you can. I think that kind of works better. That's fine. Now, uh, perfect. All resources you have stored in the mech. Oh, you just go up enough and they go up by themselves. Cool. Make some upgrades. Open the menu by pressing the U button. Digger, mech, and machine gun. On the left side, you can choose a module to upgrade mech, minor weapon, and other modules that we will find during the run. In the middle, you can select specific upgrades um, of the module. On the right-hand side, you can see the description of the selected module. The tutorial is quite good. It kind of showing. Now you can buy any upgrades to your liking. I feel like you want to be able to click this so you can kind of halt at any time. But I quite like how you kind of show it as you go, and then you just click to make it go faster if you want. So it looks like we've got multiple resources we have to find in probably harder areas. Uh, drill power, carry slow down. Jeez, it's gonna be, oh no, I can't buy anything here, so that's probably good for me at the moment. Okay. Drill power, digger speed, or carry slow down. Probably drill power, potentially. Always seems a good option to start with. So yeah, definitely getting vibes of Dome Keeper. Um, close the upgrade window by pressing escape button. Cool. Go to the cave, exit, and press the E to get back inside the mech. The, uh, when I'm like digging and stuff, it just feels a little bit bloaty or something. I'm not sure what Dome Keeper does with theirs to make it a bit more tactile or something. I'd have to go back and have a look at that. Oh, we're getting like research points or something. Maybe that's meta progression. I'm not sure. All right, cool. But feels good. I like the uh, concept. Everything looks pretty good so far. Find another cave to get more resources. I know exactly where one is. So the gun kind of moves slowly, but this moves quick. I like that. That's kind of cool. It's going to make a bit of a uh, panicking when you're trying to run for it. Soon the monster will enter your zone. Pay attention to the timer. Oh, yeah. Like, I can't see a timer. How deep is this cave? I can press E whenever I want, but it slows me down. How much? Oh, yeah. Okay. How do I drop? Uh-oh. Okay, Q. Oh, you can still kind of pick them up. I like it where you kind of, like, got weird stuff like that happening where you can kind of potentially... Juggle more as a risk. All right, 20 seconds. Let's chuck those in. And we'll grab a couple more. Yeah, definitely like holding down E would be better. I guess we'll get prepared. I could have got a few more. All right, U to upgrade. Got 10. Let's upgrade a machine gun. Rotation speed seems pretty good. Or power. Or let's... Well, that's a even double, like it's trip, tripling it. Oh no, shoot per re reload. Okay, so it's tripling the, the amount of bullets you have. Yeah, that seems like a pretty strong upgrade there. Oh. 
Like what? So we've got just power and rotation so far. It'd be cool to get like ricochets and other things like that to make it more unique rather than just damage. I'm sure that you've got that in mind. Um, and I don't, I don't know what else. Lightning to shock or fire lays on the ground, etc., etc. Uh, mech repair, mech speed, and mech health. Looks pretty good. I, I can't think off the top of my head. Like you can do, you can do some funky things. I think would be great instead of just the standard dig, drill, and slow down. But yeah, pretty cool. Two, we could get digger speed. So, grab that. Okay. Let's get ready to rumble. So that's my current weapon. I don't know if you get multiple. I guess you could get different mechs. Use the mouse and click on the left button to shoot. Yep, makes sense. I guess like... I don't want to be too harsh because it's definitely a demo kind of build. Um, but the sound's very repetitive, I guess. But uh, yeah, it, it does look pretty cool still. I like the uh, look of the mech here. So we've got 50 seconds. Are we supposed to be digging within that? I guess so. So it's going to be pretty... Um... Oh, we got all got like a relic or something. Okay. That's cool. Bring it up. Select a relic. Oh, okay. This is cool. Maybe it does. Yeah. Okay. It's done what I what I was saying. Adds explosive bullets. One explosive range one. So is that? It only adds one damage around it. What's the current damage? It's like five or something. I always like to be able to look at my own weapons and stuff while this is up to get a reference. But auto repair the mech. It seems pretty powerful. I don't know how much buy or anything. Um, shotgun. This is adding an extra weapon. This is shotgun. Um, shoots per reload, reload time, and damage. Explosive damage. Seems really strong, but like the explosive part, but it doesn't look like it's doing much damage. It is blue. Okay, you got different rarities, or maybe just different. This is a mech one, and this is a turret one, and this is. A gun one, maybe? I don't know if that's the case. We'll have a look at the explosives and see if it is just one damage and doesn't do much or not. I've got 40 seconds. Let's keep going. Okay, we've got harder ground and softer ground. I don't know what the optical, optimal uh, payload is to grab. Yeah, the time limit's definitely a lot quicker than, uh, you know, you have to get in and get out. I don't mind it. Gives you a bit of warning. Okay. Alright, quick, 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 quick. So we can keep staying at this one, I guess, as well. We zoom out. Can't zoom out any more than this. Whoa. That's very noisy. Um, just turn down the effects a bit. Green shake. Turn that down a little bit. People don't like that. All right. FPS unlimited. 69. Very interesting number. That'll be enough. 60 would be good. Okay. Back. Oh god. Was things moving while we're uh I think Oh we're in trouble. We're in trouble guys. Maybe I should have picked the auto repair. Let's get down, let's get down. Oh. What the did I press something? Oh, I was pressing E to grab the wrist. Oh, that probably needs to change, potentially. Maybe space bar to get out or something. Because you've got resources close by. 
I'm not sure. This will be a relic again. Okay. They're pretty powerful, so let's grab that. Yeah, there's just definitely something about the digging doesn't feel tactile for some reason. I don't know. I don't know if that's the right word as well. Uh, Napalm Launcher. Fire damage splash radius. This they, they were getting on top of me just then. This is artillery. Damage, reload, shots. De detonation charges. So we've got fire damage or explosive damage. Explosive range. Oh, that's a way bigger range. I don't know, let's try the napalm. Do they have a whole nother upgrade tree? I haven't really been upgrading, have I? Need to upgrade our carrying capacity. So, okay, we do. We've got explosive bullets. But what about the other thing we just got, the napalm launcher? Potentially not. Maybe it just increases the power of everything? Or is that a specific thing? I'm not sure. This would be good as well, but I feel like... Mech auto repair. We don't have any green yet. So that would probably have been a pretty good pickup. We could die soon. Uh, let's get some carry speed. So it's a nice, easy one. I like it that you don't have to worry here. I love that in Domekeeper as well. Just to relax, consolidate what you're doing. Um, it could be an option that you have to kind of do this within the time limit, which would be pretty crazy, but, um, I like it. Health. 25, current health. Oh, it gives you an extra max health, current health. So adding 25 max health and also giving you 50. That's cool. I like it. Which we probably should grab. Um... We could grab a whole lot more damage. I think... Can we grab this and this? I think we can. I feel like that's probably important. Okay. Back. Escape would be great. Oh, it does. Never mind. Never mind. It does do that already. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Alright. Oh, it's my napalm launcher. So how do I... Does it automatically? Do we, like, hide in the corner? Can they get up from the um, side of the map? That would be freaky. Whoa. Oh, that's my napalm launcher. Okay. It was a bit different than I expected, I guess. Okay, we're gonna get in trouble here. How strong is it? Like, is that gonna take out minions? Yeah, I feel like that's pretty good. Oh, a little boss kind of thing. And I'm guessing they're going to have bosses later that are kind of like you got to dodge them maybe or something. The sound feels a little bit overwhelming. The gunfights. Just giving feedback. There's a lot of good things going on here. I like it. Oops. I don't know if there's anything inside these areas. And I think in the in the like when it's fully released, there's going to be like story elements that you can go deeper and deeper. What is this? Oh, probably shouldn't have pressed that. Oh, there's a bomb. Oh, okay. <laughs> hey, maybe I should have pressed that. They didn't tell me about a bomb. All right. Well, that made things a bit easier. When did I get a bomb? It's flashed at me, but I got 12 seconds. No, I shouldn't. I shouldn't. This is the old, the old thing that you got to worry about, isn't it? All right. You can click on that. That's handy. I can't change between guns, but it shows you what I've got. Oh, we've got little worms. We've got a decent amount of different mobs already. Oh gosh, we're gonna get overwhelmed! Wait, how is my health so high?
And I'm gonna you get so confused of where you've been and where you haven't. A cool upgrade would be to um mark locations where you've been and haven't been. We're getting we're getting pretty far to start with, so it's not bad. Probably should add some music in the background. Well, I might do that myself. So my mech is, seems fine at the moment. I got 10 armor. Do I have armor at the start? Oh, look how many we've got here. We've got tons. Um, I want to keep kind of doing this. Because we're, we're nearly at the bottom already. We've got to get green stuff. Rotation speed is pretty important. So this, I can upgrade the explosive damage. Okay. Yeah, because that was a specific one I got for this. But you can't upgrade your other guns. I don't know if that's going to come or not. There's room. Um, mech speed doesn't seem as important currently. But doing more damage, potentially. Carrying more. What's the difference? Oh, it's quite small. Damage is big. Carry. Carry slowdown plus one. So I can carry an extra one unit. Is that what it's saying there? Six and two. We'll grab this. Yeah. 30 seconds on the clock. Okay, we're pretty slow. Looks like that's all there is in this one. It'd be great to get it all and know, or not know, because it's not gonna we have to remember where everything is. It's more. Oh, there's way more. Okay, never mind. Go, go, go! Oh gosh, it's gonna get heaps hard. Is it better to stay in one of these little areas? The movement seems pretty good now. Oh, there's a big dude. Okay. Okay, so there is kind of bosses. Oh, he's hard to kill because he just goes so quick. Take him out, take him out, take him out. Nearly gone. Easy, easy. One minute, 20 seconds. Go, 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 go. So I wonder if there's green around anywhere. Another relic. Throw these up here quickly. Guess if we can get a speed boost. We need green. We'll grab that while we're here. I wonder how much relics take to hold compared to gear. Looks like we can carry relics and gear easy. Shotgun, electric gun, damage, reload, shots per reload. I'm guessing that would hit multiple targets. A rocket launcher. This is main rocket gun. Reload, shots per reload, damage. I don't know what's going to come at me. We get a rocket gun. these chuck them up there where's our green we're gonna have to start moving out a bit more eh? it'd be cool to know how many's in a section as well instead of having three each time have the amount and you know whether to go. i guess i don't i just can't remember what don't keep it did maybe maybe don't keep it did the same thing and you never know just never know. Maybe I can go further down than I think. Yeah, gotta go. It's telling me I've got to go. It's a lot of gold. You quick. So we could get some of these. We may as well. Max speed. Health. What is our current health? 
Our current health is 35. Because, oh, because we fought that boss. Well, this seems like a pretty good pick. Now we need green. We've got everything. Okay. Well, we'll grab this because we got eight. So that's not green. All right, here we go. So let's try and move a little bit to see if we can find some green somewhere. We ought to have different colored, you know, this bowl. It's even louder than the other one. All right, so we've got to work on the effect sounds a bit. It's gonna to have to be turned down again. That's, that's so loud. So loud. It's going to turn everything else down, I guess. It's going to be some pre-production. Definitely doesn't seem as strong either. That, I don't know. Um, all. That's a bit better. So my fire should take care of them. I love that fire, the uh, napalm. That is life-saving. All right, I'm gonna try and go down to this bottom one as quick as I can. We've got 33 health left. This seems like the end of the road. Oh no, it keeps going. seems pretty far away though so hopefully we'll get some green in here realistically i don't need any blue do i i guess i can my mech can move faster but we're mainly looking for we're going to need blue as well with the green Yeah, it's, it's got the bones. There's, there is some improvement that could happen. I'd have to sit down and think about it, I guess. Um, I've said some of the stuff, though. And the, the sound makes a big difference as well, because I've, I've got no music playing. Okay. Are we getting green further down here? This is pretty deep. Oh, there's some green. Oh, let's grab them. Get out of here. Oh, no. Don't, Adam. Where's some speed boots? Oh, we could drop that. I forgot. It'd be handy before. Oh, it's going to be tough. All right, hand them in. Get some stuff going. Uh, three. Don't need to dig a speed boost. Mech repair. What does that do? 32 to 32, 65. This is a mech repair. What does that even mean? Explosive damage plus one. Well, we can get explosive damage and mech repair. Uh oh. You got a, you got a few seconds. Oh, there's a worm up there. I can see. It's gonna be people behind us, I'm sure. Okay. Behind us is kind of safe with this purple thing, except it's moving. It seems to go to the closest target, which is good. Uh oh. We've got explosive dudes coming on us. We're dead. <laughs> Your robot is destroyed. Meta currency. Okay. I don't want to restart. I want to go back to the main menu, but that might not be possible. Yes. Skip tutorial. Yes. So there might not be a main menu. So there's no meta progression yet implemented. All right. Um, so what, what time? What time is it? Let's have a look. Only 24 minutes. I feel like there isn't too much more differences, I guess, here. We've gone through a lot of it. Um, so I think it's a good little first impressions. All right, so what, what, am I th what am I thinking? I think it's got definitely good promise. Um, so like if I go in to look at the 
the upgrade menu here. We've got time to look at this. Um, I could it's like unique builds could be cool. So I, I would take take guidance from the Dome Keeper that was so successful, as well as um, what is it, World World World, um, and like make unique builds potentially. So I don't know, like you could grab a grappling hook or something to pull yourself up. Or maybe you can kick off walls or something. That would be a unique little thing you could go do. And then when you grab your resource, you can jump off the floor and go really quick or something up. Or just some just some random things you could do that make it more unique and different every time you play. The relics are cool. I'd have to look at them to figure out the direction they're going. Because you've got your guns and stuff, but they kind of work automatically. And you can't upgrade them to different ways either. I'm not sure. Do you have like a smaller amount of guns but then you have their own little trees that you could build them out a little bit differently or something and you could maybe control another one with your right with your different mouse button or something so you could kind of aim one or aim the other but then you, it's hard to move them both so i'm not sure um and then you like unique mech upgrades as well like maybe a jump so you could jump out of trouble or a grappling hook as well I'm just thinking of World World, I guess. But you can uh, grab onto some of the rocks and stuff to pull yourself around. I'm guessing some of these things probably are in the works because it's only demo build. But um, that's what I'm kind of thinking. And probably a more organic looking... Um, God, it's hard to dig. I didn't realize. Uh, very solid bricky walls and stuff. Like they got a little bit of stuff going on here. But and again, it's only demo. It's just things I'm, I'm thinking of. I like the little effects that come out when you break them and stuff. So that's cool. But um, yeah, I think it's got promise so far. Looking forward to seeing what the, uh, the what the devs do with it. And thank you for sending me a little review code before uh, too many people get to see it. So that's kind of cool. If you uh, like what you see here, guys, you can wishlist it yourself and help the developers out. That way you can like the video to let more people know. You can share it. That'd be great. Uh, and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of these kind of things in the future. Thanks so much, guys. That's it. Wife Falcon out.